What up boys and welcome back to yet another video. So we have another Dragonflight gold farm and this is absolutely mental because we're dealing with a secret hidden mount here and every time the word secret mount is thrown around everyone instantly thinks of at least Nagomic opportunity. Is there a way that I can capitalize on that? I'm sure you'll remember the um uh, the shadow weave masks that we had was that early bfa or something like that which printed millions of gold and this one in today's video is quite similar so before we jump right into it i do want to say big thank you to everyone that has picked up the zero to 10 million gold guide the support has been insane and i'm so glad that you guys are liking the dragonflight updates so if you want to get it make sure you use the discount code dragonflight and you will get it for 50 percent off and that includes all future updates so if you get the book today you will receive all the updates that I do to the book automatically at your email whenever I upload it for like the, the next decade. So um, today's farm, like I'm not, I don't want any credits for figuring out this uh, secret mount. Let me just make that very clear, right? There's like a whole Discord dedicated for finding these kind of things. So this is uh, this is not on me. I just I'm trying to look at how I can make gold from it, and I've been spammed on Discord. From people that have been doing this for, well, probably like 12 hours as soon as this video goes out. But I was asleep, so I couldn't uh, jump on it the, the moment it went live. Uh, basically, Wowet has a very good guide on like how to get it. But we're going to go through it in this video. How to get the mount and then how you can make a shit ton of gold on it. And if this is the sort of content that you guys are interested in, you got to make sure that you subscribe to the YouTube channel. Because the last videos that I've uploaded in Dragonflight, like you got to jump on those farms fast because if you're like six hours after everyone else sometimes even two hours the prices might have plummeted so make sure that you subscribe to the youtube channel and you'll be notified uh, whenever i upload a video okay so first of all in order to get this mount you need to give um, an npc 20 of each of these uh, food like the flash frozen meat nolan's house special and tuscar jerky that's all that's required. You can buy these off the auction house and just go and hand them into the NPC and um, you'll get the mount, right? However, look at the price. Tuscar jerky, that's almost 2,000 gold each, 1,500 gold each for the flash frozen meat. And Nolan's house special, 60 gold each. Now, a lot of people won't mind because this is, uh, what, like 40,000 gold plus uh, 30,000 gold. And this is not really that much, like 1,200 gold. So it's like 70,000 gold uh, for a mount. And that's nothing. People pay way more than 70,000 gold for a mount. Which is great for us because people consider these prices to be fair for a new mount, right? It's cheap. Imagine like back in BFA when people had to buy Dune Scavengers and Golden Mains that those flew off the auction house. This is way cheaper. So that means that we will be able to sell this without any issue. And everyone that's been sending me screenshots of sales, like this shit is popping off. So in order to get these meats, like two of them is pretty straightforward. The first one, the, uh, the Nolan's house special is very cheap because... It can drop from this uh, hyper spawn that is very well known. It's like the fastest, uh, it's basically the gold farm that gives you the highest amount of kills per hour. We're talking like up to 10,000 kills an hour. And they drop like all the time. So I actually had these marked as junk because I would just vendor them because they were they were useless. So I've sold thousands of these to the vendor. Uh, kind of regret that now. Right? I really do. And if I paid attention, uh, I would have actually kept these. Because on, on the beta, people figured out like kind of two of the ingredients, but they were stuck on the last one, which we will get to. But that's like one of the locations where you could farm the first one. I would highly recommend you to go to this spot. You can see that there's some random people right here pugging this farm already. Now, uh, next up, we have uh, the one that's called the Tuscar Jerky. Tuscar Jerky, there's a couple of locations where you can farm it, but uh, I would definitely recommend you guys to kill the, the nulls around the, this water right here. Like this base has a ton of, uh, I think they're called like dark tooth, the mobs. Kill those. The drop chance just is not too bad, considering the price is actually fairly decent for that one. The last one is a bit more tricky, and that's why people were stuck on the beta trying to find them out. Because in order to get the, uh, the last one, you guys got to actually do like this uh this side quest it's not a part of the main story but you kind of have to do the main story in order to unlock the side quest so you gotta head over to uh this guy 
that's located right here in the Asher's pad. He's called Old Grim Tusk. And then you have to, to uh, pick up the quests from him, and you have to do the quests until you've done uh, the, the True Survivor quest. Now, once you've done the True Survivor quest, you can kill the Nulls in the icy area, and uh, like at the camps, and then you will be able to get the uh, the proper food, the, the one that is called uh, the, the Flash Frozen Meat. That's why that one is the most expensive one, because not everyone has done those quests, so they haven't unlocked them yet. And the numbers kind of speaks for themselves, uh, like you guys saw the uh, the prices on these, and they are selling extremely fast. Like everything uh, right here is moving extremely fast because uh, people are finally on EU are starting to wake up now, and they're starting to see the the Twitter posts and the Wowit posts and the YouTube videos about the secret mount. So uh, I myself, uh, like right now, this one just sold. I did the second I posted it. So uh, this stuff will be very good. Uh, once again, highly, highly recommend you guys to subscribe to the YouTube video so you can watch these videos fast because once this video goes out, there's going to be a lot of people jumping onto it. And uh, don't forget to check out the 0 to 10 million gold guide. But that's all I had. If anything was unclear, I'm going to link the Dwawed post down below in the description. Make sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel, check out the 0 to 10 million gold guide, and I will see you all back in at the next video. But until then... Bye-bye.